What's up, my friend? Welcome to this amazing day, my friends. You gotta feel it, my friend. This day is for you, my friend. I got your answer, my friend, today. Today, I got your secret sauce, my friend. I know, I know why you're so confused as to how good you really are. I know why you keep being confused with whether you're good enough or you're not good enough. Some days you feel like you're more than, than good enough, then other days you feel like you're not even in the arena, like you're so bad that you don't even want to be seen, my friend. I know why it's such a wide range of confidence, my friend. I got your answer today, my friend. I hope you listen real, real closely, my friend. I'm going to take my time and say this video with clarity, my friend, because I want you to win. That's what this is all about. The game is played on the outside, but the game of life is one on the inside in your mind. I know why you're so confused about how good you really are, my friend. Some days you think you're the best in the world. Other days you think you're not even good enough to be seen, my friend. I know why. The wide range of confidence. I know what it is, my friend. You keep competing against people. That's the problem, my friend. You got to stop competing against people. Let me tell you why, right? See, competing with other people can be beneficial, right? But competing against other people is both a waste of time and energy. And here's why. Because you can't measure your own growth and development while competing against other people. Because you can't measure the other person's effort. So in other words, competing against other people is wasting your time and energy because you don't know how hard the other person is going. You don't know the effort the other person is put, putting in, so you can't measure your own growth according to the competition with the other person. Because you don't know whether they're going half speed, you don't know if they're giving you all that they got, you don't know their effort. So as a result, you can't measure your own growth and development. So competing against other people, you still don't know where you stand. Because you don't know their effort. You don't know the level of commitment they were putting into it. So you can't measure your own growth, my friend. Competing against other people is both a waste of time and energy. But here's three strategies that can help you, my friend. Number one, here's the thing. See, in order... For you to be able to measure consistent growth and development in and throughout your life, you got to compete against yourself, my friend. That's the only way you're going to be able to continuously measure your growth and development. Competing against yourself, my friend. Let me tell you something else. Number two is the thing. When you compete against you, right? When you compete against yourself, there's a 100% chance and there's only 100% within the chance. There's a 100% chance, so it's a guarantee that you get the W. See, when you compete against yourself, it's a 100% guarantee that you win. So for me, it's not rocket science, it's an easy one. Stop competing against other people. Compete with other people, compete with them, you know, glean from them, learn some stuff, compete with them because that can be beneficial. But competing against other people is wasting your time and your energy, my friend. Number three, here's the thing. You gotta develop a greatness mindset, yes. A mind bold enough to believe, here's the thing. See, when you compete against other people, it forces you to focus solely on them. Because when you're competing against them, you wanna see exactly how they do so you can try to make yourself do better. So when you compete against other people, it forces you to focus solely on them and it takes your focus away from who's most important. You! So when you compete against other people, you're constantly looking at them, and it's taking your focus away from who's most important. You! And this is why. Because all of the answers to life problems are in the mirror. Not in his mirror or her mirror, in your mirror, my friend. So when you compete against other people, it's taking you away from growth and development and is taking you away from the answers that'll help you go higher and go further, my friend. Stop competing against people. It's a waste of time and energy. You can compete with other people because that can be beneficial. 
but competing against other people is a waste of time and energy because you can't measure your growth and development because you can't measure your opponent's effort, my friend. Stop competing against people. That's why it's such a wide range in your confidence, my friend. Compete against you and you'll be confident. You'll stay confident, my friend. And never forget, confidence comes from three places. Belief in God, belief in yourself, and belief in your preparation, my friend. So prepare every day to be great by first having a gratitude session with God because life is like real estate. Whatever we appreciate increases in value, but whatever we don't appreciate decreases in value. And immediately after you had a gratitude session with God, you gotta put on your amazing, my friend, because once you put on that amazing, that becomes your full body of armor so you can stand firm against the wiles of the enemy because the enemy is surely lurking my friend but you can't lose my friend as long as you stop competing against people compete with people because that can be beneficial but never against people because you can't measure your growth and development because you can't measure your opponent's effort let me give you this before we leave my friend never forget this i'm gonna let you walk away with this my friend you were born to be great